All right, welcome to week three in CIT 15. This is your attendance post for online. So by the time you get in here, you'll see your new item. Just to kind of make a comment here for those of you watching this on Monday before your first My IT Lab assignment. The reason I really try to recommend working ahead is the benefit of if you run into issues, you have alternatives. So part of the My Screens was having you think about an alternative computer you would use because this is a reality sometimes that hits us especially as it relates to the simulation software but having said that what I really want to make sure you understand as well is that those folks part of what you bought was their support so when you go to my IT lab and you go to support 2016 is the version we're using what you can see here is how to get help Red, contact them directly. Uh, you can make sure your computer is set up correctly. Most of the time the things that I've seen related to this is just a pop-up blocker so that if you're going into the software and it doesn't actually pop up or you're wondering if it didn't do anything, the pop-up blocker is usually to, to account for that. So anyway, we're moving into our week three of the semester. Really important um, that you're doing the work or getting help if you need that as well. Um, I, ne I noticed this morning I graded work submitted over the weekend, so some of you are working ahead, which is really awesome. So just to give you that, you know, make sure you're clear on this, is that our first My IT Lab item, and I've moved over to a tab for My IT Lab, is not Windows 10. Now you can do the Windows 10 exam if you want, uh, and I will allow you to use it for late points return, something I talked about in week two. But our first item here <coughs> is Windows 20, sorry, Word 2016. So here's the training, and here's the exam. Remember, I don't give you points for this, but this is where you get the points, but this will get you ready to do this, okay? And then you'll, there's a video for showing you how to submit your scores, so make sure you do follow that. And then heads up, this week we have a new item, which is our first Code Academy. So just good to keep track, make sure you understand where you're at with this class. Uh, always check in your grade to make sure you're clear about how things, if you've missed something, you will see a zero. Uh, if there's something that you got wrong, um, I will give you feedback and if you've done it before the due date, you can redo it. But uh, understand that once it's past the due date and if you fix something, it may not increase your grade. Hope you had a good weekend. Um, feel really bad and just praying for the people in Texas this weekend. Uh, I know for me, I spent the weekend uh, down judging a coding competition downtown. If you heard any of the news coverage of it, it was wonderful. I was on the judging panel and it's really cool to see the technology industry really blossom here in Fresno. So if you think um, there's not a tech industry, well, it's because you're not looking because there really, really is. So if tech is your thing, uh, it's a great time to be around and watch things grow. All right, the very last thing I will say to you is a really awesome thing that's happening on campus this week is that there's a student appreciation week. So they're giving away free cookies, Dutch Brothers. Uh, this is uh, this whole week. Uh, they're giving away cookies. They're having Dutch Brothers there on Wednesday. They're doing floats Thursday, juice and corn nuts. So <clears throat> take advantage of some of these uh, things on campus if you happen to be around campus. If not, maybe come on campus to do that because that would be the other thing going back to our work is that if you can work it out that if you don't have a computer working coming on campus and going to the lab is a great idea okay so make sure in your post for this week on the attendance you just do a watch and replied so I know you're keeping track I try to keep these relatively short have a great wonderful week